Suppose there's a company who takes advantage of the murdered native children in Canada by harvesting their remains and growing their cell lines in a lab to test their products. Would you support that company? Would you buy their products? Nobody in their right mind would. Or suppose there's a company who took advantage of George Floyd's death by harvesting his remains and growing his cell lines in a lab to test their products. Would you support that company? Would you buy their products? Nobody in their right mind would. Or suppose there's a company who took advantage of the dehumanized and murdered Holocaust victims by harvesting their remains and growing their cell lines in a lab to test their products. Would you support that company? Would you buy their products? Nobody in their right mind would. Yet today, we have companies that take advantage of dehumanized and murdered human beings by harvesting their remains and using their cell lines to test their products. It's about time we stop supporting these companies. It's about time we stop using their products. And to the politicians who push these products on their people, have you lost your mind? And you think you're more civilized? You think you've advanced? You have devolved. You have degenerated. But the fact of the matter is, these products can be designed, can be produced, and can be tested without using those very grossly unethical practices. The politician and his entire party who was responsible for the Holocaust, as evil as they were, will rise up on the Day of Judgment and condemn the politicians of today that practice and condone and promote such evil practices. As I speak, there are thousands and thousands of truckers rolling across Canada to meet in Ottawa January 29th to oppose this evil. Pray for peace and pray that God's righteousness and justice prevail. God bless Freedom Convoy. 2022.